it's Thrifty Tiffany and I am back with a Goodwill thrift haul and y'all I'm so excited to be here with you guys today. It's been a while since I've done a thrift haul and I did have a couple of requests to do one so I thought you know what I'm gonna take myself to the thrift store. I went to like four different Goodwill stores out here in Atlanta and I had a ball. Um, oh my gosh I found so many cool items. I found the boys some clothes. I found some decor items. I found myself some clothes, some spring clothes, so I was really, really excited. And if you're new, my name is Tiffany and welcome to my channel. I hope you stay and subscribe and hit that bell button so you're notified every time that I upload. And if you're a current subscriber, thank you so much for all your continued love and support. Also, if y'all don't know yet, we are almost at 90,000 subscribers, which I cannot believe, but I am doing a giveaway. So check out the video before this video and look into how you need, what you need to do to enter. Uh, I would love for all of you guys to enter so you have a chance to win. There will be six winners and I do little bundles. So I'm really excited to give back to you guys. And I love when I find all those name brand things from Dollar Tree and I love gifting them away because they're so, so good. Um, so yes, so check out that video for the giveaway rules and how to enter and all of that. Also check me out on Instagram at thriftytiffany35. I do do giveaways over there as well. And this won't be the last giveaway. Of course, once we reach 100,000 subscribers, I'll do another giveaway then, and that will even be bigger and better. I try to get bigger and better with each giveaway, but I'm so excited for that. So that's just a little update. Definitely check out those videos. I posted a lot of videos last week, so check out any just scroll through my recent post and check those out. But we're gonna jump into this thrift haul. I am so excited, I am so excited. So this first thing I have to show you, you all have probably seen it in the thumbnail, stumbling over my words as usual. You just have to kind of ignore that <laughs> or expect it from me, one or the other. But oh my goodness, oh my goodness. I So I've never heard of this artist, but I've done research ever since I found this picture because the picture is absolutely stunning. When you see it, you're gonna say, that looks exactly like Tiffany because I love vintage, I love floral, I love French, I love just, I just, I just love it. I don't know what, I just love floral, vintage, and all of that. So let me show you this. Oh my gosh, look at this picture that I got. Oh my gosh. And it's by an artist. I think her name is Sarah Moon because she signs it. So it's by the artist Sarah Moon. She used to be a model, but then became a photographer. And she was from France is what I believe. I did some research just a little bit, but all of her artwork is absolutely stunning. At this point, I'm invested. Like I want more of her pieces. She has so many pretty pieces. I think, sorry, you have the window. I think this is so unique and just gorgeous. If I can put it up closer, I'll just, sorry, I don't want you to see, but look how gorgeous she is. Look how stunning this picture is. I am obsessed. So this is not, this is like a picture on a piece of wood. I don't know. I've tried to look this up and on the back, this picture itself is called Claudia. So I'm guessing that girl's name is Claudia, but look at the floral and the colors. Kaya says it looks scary, <laughs> but I absolutely love it. I mean, she's just captivating. I literally saw it and had to have it. And once it was in my cart, everyone was looking at my cart like, oh my gosh, that picture is gorgeous. I love when you find things like that at Google or any thrift store. But this was only $5.99. Oops, $5.99 if you can see it right there. And it's heavy, it's on a piece of wood. So I am obsessed now. Now I want all of her pieces. She has this other one that I really, really want after I started looking into it, but oh my goodness, this is gorgeous. I'm not sure where I'm gonna put it yet. Definitely in my bedroom. I just don't know where. Um, it just, it goes with my theme. It's just me. I think it's absolutely classic and gorgeous. So I found this and was so, so excited. I know you guys are probably like, yep, Tiffany, that's you. That's all you. It's so pretty. I don't know what what do you call this leaving the uh, link below if you know it's literally on a piece of wood so you can't take the picture off it's like on to the wood i don't know what you call this because i was trying to look it up but yep i'm so excited about it i'm beyond excited about this picture 
Like it's your wards and it's huge as you can see. It's absolutely huge. So also we'll just stay in the decor for a second. I found this gorgeous pitcher. Now this color is in this season. This little muted lime green, like pastel green. It's absolutely gorgeous. Look at this, this thing is huge. This is a huge pitcher. So I haven't decided, I love this color. I just don't have anything else in my house this color, but I absolutely love it. And it's just an in right now. And um, this was $4.99, $4.99 is absolutely gorgeous, but I can also do the whole hack where you take like chalk paint, I believe, and then you add baking soda to it and then you give it a whole rustic look. So I could do that with it or just leave it this really pretty pastel lime green. You guys let me know what you would do. Would you try to do the little hack that makes it look like it's a terracotta plant, a uh, planter? Or what is it called, like a clay? It's supposed to look like it's clay if you add the baking soda or cornstarch or something, some hack. But let me, got, let me know if you would do that or if you would just keep it this lime green. But again, it's pale. It's, it's just, I'm gonna get my nails this color after I get this purple off. This color is so pretty, I love it. So I got this picture, $4.99. That is a steal because it's absolutely huge. And it's ceramic. And then, of course, you guys know, I found a coffee cup. But look how pretty this coffee cup is. It's like ceramic and just to kind of coffee cups that I like that look like somebody made it in their house. That's what I'm going for. And I love having a, not like a set of coffee cups, just unique different ones. That's what I love. This is only 99 cents and look how pretty it is. It's absolutely gorgeous. I was so excited about this. So pretty. So I'll grab that. And then I got some glass dishes. If you've ever watched I'm sweating already. If you've ever watched a one of my cook with me's, um, I have a lot of glass dishes. Now, some of my glass bowls are from Dollar Tree. I have glass plates, glass bowls, and I have the coffee or tea mugs that are glass from Dollar Tree. But I also have some glass bowls. I have a square glass bowl when I made, I forgot what it was. Oh, baked oatmeal and I have my square glass bowl. A lot of questions, people ask where did I get the glass bowl from? It, Cause it's square. It's from a thrift store, it's from Goodwill. So I love picking up, always go to the glass section. At Goodwill you will find some unique bowls and stuff. Now these are anchor bowls, but I got two small bowls and it's such a thick glass. It's such a thick glass. These were only 59 cents. 59 cents, I got two of them, 59 cents each. And they are the anchor bowls and they're very thick. You can put your yogurt with your granola, make you a nice little yogurt bowl or an acai bowl or whatever you wanna make, your ice cream bowl. And then I found these, which I love because it's like a flat bowl. I don't know, I just absolutely love these. You can put you a nice salad or pasta. I got two from two different stores. This one was $1.99 and this one was $1.29. So each store had it at a different price. But oh my goodness, I love these and these are the Anchor brand and it's such a thick glass and I just love being able to see the food, like the salad and for pictures, for Instagram, it works out perfect when you have a nice pretty glass bowl. So always keep your eye out at Goodwill and thrift stores like that for different unique bowls. I love to have them in the house. Even though it's just classic glass, it really sets off a picture of your food or just presentation is everything when it comes to eating. You always want it to look really nice. Um, so yes, so I got those. Now to move on to some clothes. So should I go through? I, I got the boys some clothes because I mean, why not I always end up finding really good Nike shorts and things like that. So let me give you a little backstory on Cash. Cash likes shorter shorts. Not real short, but shorter shorts. He doesn't like the long ones that go to his knee. He just likes a shorter short, kind of like a golfing short almost. Um, so I love to go to Goodwill and stuff like that to find his because they're already worn in. They have already shrunk and you know what size they're, that they're gonna be. So he came up in this little thrift haul. And now I'm gonna get to my clothes. I'm gonna show you my clothes. Cause oh my goodness, just wait, you won't believe it. Okay, so I'm just gonna show you, kind of go through his kind of quick. Oh, well first these are, I'll save that for my, my stack over here. <clears throat> I did get t-shirts. We love 
worn in vintage looking graphic tees, any kind of tee. It could be from some place, some tourist t-shirt. We just love vintage old tees, band tee, any just kind of old, just tee. <laughs> so I found this, we love a good Chevy y'all. I found this for the boys. It says Chevy trucks, dependable, long and lasting. Y'all, my dad is a Chevy man, so he made us a Chevy, you know, we're just a Chevy family. So I love this shirt. It's worn in, it's vintage. It's like just a vintage tee. It's so cute. I love it. It's great for the boys to wear. My boys wear this stuff like that all the time. Then I found this tee, which was really cool. It's just a Georgia, just a Georgia tee. Yellow, yellow looks so good on all three of my kids with their skin complexion. It just, it looks gorgeous on them. I love yellow and yellow and blue is so pretty. Oh, the price, sorry. Oh, and the color at Goodwill is orange this week. So I didn't really get much of any orange, but these were blue. The, the shirts are $2.99. Not sure if you can see it, but the shirts are $2.99 for the men's t-shirts. Oh, this one was orange, so I got this half off. Okay, so this one was half off. And then I got this, which is really, when you go to the Salty Dog, like at Panama City Beach or Hilton Head or wherever, these shirts are expensive. But I found him, see we love these type of t-shirts. I found them the Salty Dog Cafe. This is from Hilton Head. And these just classic t-shirts. Cash loves to wear these with some little shorts. That's it, that's what he wears. These were, this was $2.99 as well. Again, you're gonna pay 25, 30 bucks for this in store. So we love these and the color is nice. Looks barely even worn, love that. Now, I also love finding uh, Ralph Lauren polo shirts, shorts, whatever. I love finding name brands when I go to Goodwill. I found this really pretty yellow and blue Ralph Lauren shirt and it's already worn and great looking. And again, $2.99, $2.99. So I got them this one, perfect for the beach y'all, perfect for the beach. Then I got here some sh another shirt, this is a Nike and this one's definitely worn in and you can tell it was an older shirt, just, just how the logo is. And it's more of like a charcoal gray at this point cause it's been used and worn but we love that look. We love a worn in look. It's crazy these days, these kids love it, but that's what we go for. The more worn in, the more used it looks, the better they like it. <laughs> then I found these Nike shorts. Now these are the length that Cash likes. See how they're shorter and not longer? So I got him these athletic Nike shorts and they have the drawstring and these shorts were $4.99, which is great for some Nikes. Wish it was half off, but it wasn't. But I picked up these Nikes and then I picked up these. These are nice, just cotton around the house. They're shorter shorts. See how short they are? He likes these brand and they're stretchy. And this is by Athletic. And these again were $4.99. So I love that. I love it. Perfect for him when he's working out, doing um, track and field and stuff like that. Those are perfect for him. Then I found these, which are actually his school colors. And these are Nike as well, and they're reversible. They're Nike and they're blue, red, and white. And then you can reverse them into the white. Thought that was really cool. And these are on the shorter side. And you never know what you're gonna find at a thrift store. So cash came up, came and didn't necessarily, I did get him a short, and Kaya didn't really get anything because you just never know what you're gonna find. I look in all the stuff, but only found a car. And these are for Cayman. He likes his longer. Cayman is taller. He's my middle son, but he is taller. So he likes a longer short. And uh, Cayman's got a little butt on him. So we have to get him the longer shorts to, to be able to sit right up on him. <laughs> He's a thick boy. So um, we got these and they're Nike and they're uh, stretchy and all that. So. Perfect for him. And again, all the shorts were $4.99. And I'll pay that for some name brand. I'll pay that for name brand and them soft shorts. I'm hot. You, I have my air on. Sorry if you hear the washing machine, Kaya's washing her clothes. Um, so now to my clothes, my, my clothes. And I got some hangers right here. So I wanna show you what it looks like on a hanger, you know, so you can see it better. So I found this gorgeous shirt right here. Um, it's so pretty. It's a, it's not silk. And this honestly looks like an older brand, like, cause it has shoulder pads in it, like an older, older brand. It's called Corette. Um, and it's just absolutely 
gorgeous. It's a ivory color, not one stain in sight, not one stain. Look how gorgeous this shirt is. I love a nice blouse. You can dress it up with some jeans and some heels. I just think it's absolutely gorgeous. Do y'all see this? I mean, she is stunning. So sheer, but not sheer, but not too sheer. But she is absolutely gorgeous. It's like a silk, but not a silk, I don't think. It says washing cold water. Yeah, this is not a silk, but look at the brand. See the brand, it's an older tag. It has, um, what do you call it, shoulder pads. I just, I just think this is absolutely gorgeous. I wish you could see it in person. The ivory is just stuck. It looks like it's never been worn, to be honest. Then I found this shirt. This is a t-shirt and this is, oh, sorry, the price. The price for this was $5.99. $5.99 for such a beautiful blouse. $5.99 for that. Then I got this, which is Abercrombie and Fitch, which we all know they're expensive. And this is just a large t-shirt, but look at the pattern on it. You know that floral. That floral is stunning. Look at it, and it's just a t-shirt. And I love an oversized t-shirt, it's XXL, because honey, I love oversized. I don't wanna have to worry about when I eat something being tight on me. But look how pretty this is, perfect for spring. Perfect for spring, like these are my colors, neutral colors, florals, just vintage look. Look at this shirt right here. Oh, that shirt, did I tell you? I think, oh, it was, it did, the tag was lost, it was $2.99 actually found that in the men's t-shirts. I don't know if it was intended on being a man's t-shirt, but it was $2.99. Look at this gorgeous shirt. This is American Eagle Outfitters. Yes, American Eagle Outfitters. And look how pretty. It's like a baby doll shirt. It flows, which I love a good flowy shirt. Again, not tight to my body. I love a good flowy shirt. It has this little tie right here. Let me just show you how pretty. Look at the sleeves. Look at how gorgeous. And this shirt was $5.99. Again, it, this was in the women blouses. So the women blouses are more than the men's tees. But this is so pretty. I love how just wavy it is and beautiful it is. Now this, I didn't know when I grabbed it was 100% silk. I don't like buying 100% silk because you have to get it dry cleaned. But it was gorgeous. And this is another older brand. It has shoulder pads. It's by Jones, New York. I remember that, but they do have shoulder pads, but I had to get it. I guess I'll take it to the dry cleaners because I got to wash all of these. But look at this and look at the florals on it. Look at those colors, y'all. See the florals? I love a beautiful blouse. You can't, it doesn't do it justice from back there, but look at how gorgeous. I love this. Guys, see that? See how pretty? And then this was $5.99, and I think it was, I think it's just absolutely stunning. It's gorgeous. It's so vintage and just classy. I love a good classy silk blouse. You can dress it up with some jeans or whatever you like, honey, anything you like. Then I found this, and this is an older one too. This is by, oh, look at this brand. This is the brand. And this is so, and it has shoulder pads. I just, it's something about that vintage, y'all. It's something about that vintage that I'm just, I love. I absolutely love the daintiness of it and just the, the beauty of it. Look at this shirt. Look at the florals. I mean, and this is like a silk. It doesn't say 100% silk, but it is beautiful short sleeve shirt. I just absolutely love these colors. It's absolutely stunning to me. And this was $5.99 as well, $6 shirt. This is not bad, y'all. That is not a bad price. Then I found, oh, I'm out of hangers. Then I found this shirt, let me take one off. Then I found this shirt right here and this velvet. And y'all, I love velvet. I love a good velvet. Now this is the back. The back hangs longer than the front. This is the front and I love that. So when you're wearing jeans that can cover up your bum a little bit. Um, I just love this green color. It's like a sage. I love me some velvet y'all. I'm a velvet girl. Um, so I absolutely love this. I don't know that brand, but that's the brand. 
and it says a small, but y'all, this is kind of large. It's large and wavy. So I picked it up. She looks beautiful. I love velvet. I'm a velvet girl. Y'all, I am, <laughs> my neck's sweating. So <laughs> I don't know why it's so hot. Maybe because it got long sleeves on, but um, yes. Okay, so now we're gonna look at this next one. I gotta take that off. Now this is for winter, but this is the best time if you wanna get some sweaters at Goodwill um, when it's not season. I found this shirt, which is Ivy Crew Classics. And I love this type of texture, but I got a long oversized sweater. I'm all here for my oversized sweaters, y'all. And it's like the sh chenille fabric. Look at that. I love a navy blue too with a light wash jean. So pretty and with a brown boot or a little tan booty. You know, you wear your brown jewelry with your navy. You wear brown with the navy but this is oversized and absolutely the fabric is gorgeous it doesn't even look like it's been worn so i found that it's oversized and i love it then i found this this one's for kaya so everybody at least got something but um oh my goodness this columbia cash loves columbia we all do actually it's a good brand um where's it at i found this columbia zip up it's a 2XL, but it's Columbia. Never worn. Large, oh, you know, large, what do you call these? Zip up sweatshirt. This was $6.99. The jackets are $6.99. Oh, this was $5.99 as well, y'all. This all the shirts, like blouses were $5.99. T-shirts were $2.99. Shorts were, what were they? $4.99? Yeah, $4.99. Um, so yes, I found this big, nice jacket. Hasn't even been worn perfect for football nights, things like that. Oh, it literally has never been worn. Perfect. And it's Columbia. Like what? I had, I tried it on last night. It was a little big on me, but Kaya's taller than me. So it fits her link a lot better. And she has been looking for a zip up. So she's going to get that one. And I found these shorts y'all. So these were in the men's section, but when I passed by them, I said, those are cute. I think those would look good high-waisted on me. Um, so, you know, that's what's in style. These are the brand Joss and Bank. And it's like a linen, like a linen short. But it has the creases in the front right there. It kind of looks like a woman's um, shorts. And they look so pretty high-waisted. I would have to show you, show you guys, like, try them on. But I can't try them on right now. But it's such a used fabric it's like a linen nice soft flexible fabric put it on high waisted and the length i tried them on they fit me perfect the length was perfect you could wear a nice little brown belt nice little white t-shirt you know nice little white t-shirt with this with some brown sandals these i loved and i couldn't believe i found them in the men's section i mean they are men's but i love them like i absolutely love them as high waist shorts so I was excited and these were only $4.99 as well. So that is it for my thrift haul. Y'all, I was so excited to share these items with you guys because, oh my gosh, you can really come up with some really cool items at Goodwill. I'm just blown away by this. This is my favorite, all-time favorite find. I literally could not believe it. It's just, just breathtaking. But um, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you had fun. Hope you enjoyed the haul. I hope this gives you a little... Gives you a little juice to want to get out there and go see what you can find at the thrift store. You can get lost in those things. I was I was having a ball. But anyway, I love you guys so much. Again, check out the video about the giveaway. Once we reach 90K is when I'm going to be doing the drawing. So go ahead to that video. Go ahead and do what you need to do to enter so you can be a, so you can enter to be one of the six winners. So thank you guys so much for staying here with me, y'all, and spending time with me and clicking on this video. But I love you guys so much, and I will see you on my next video. Bye, y'all.